Sanders underneath. He's got Weaver again. Looking for the first with a block. Weaver at a burst. Still on the move. Stays on his feet and finally goes down deep. The Nebraska Terrence. mark of the fourth quarter. Shador Sanders looking. Steps up. Wants a run. Okay, so Colorado took care of business this week. They beat Nebraska. My cousin had to eat crow. He hit me after the game. He said, man, dog, man, we some trash, man. Um, now, I wouldn't really call him trash because I thought that defense was solid. But before I get started, I have to say congratulations to Deion Sanders and the Colorado football team for taking care of business. But, yeah, I didn't think uh, Nebraska was trash. I thought their defense was solid. Uh it took them too long to, to, to generate uh, offense, to get going on offensively. Um, they had the turnovers. That put them behind the eight ball. It was just a, it was a, a rough game for Nebraska all the way around. Um, but I saw some interesting things on that, on that Colorado side of the football. One is that Dion, I, he probably has unlimited weapons over there on the offensive side of the ball. I mean, this dude Weaver – just seen to come out of nowhere, man. And he was making big plays. Um, of course, Travis Hunter did what he did. Shador was Shador. But I noticed this about Shador. I did notice this today. When you get pressure on him, right, he'll, I, I believe he'll throw it to you if, you if you get the right amount of pressure on him. I, he, he looks like he's a little reckless with the way he throws that ball under pressure. Now, I know no quarterback wants to sit there and look down a barrel of the gun every time and get hit, you know, but I just thought he was just a little reckless for my taste with how he was throwing that ball away when, um, when he was getting blitzed. But overall, I got to give Colorado their props. They took care of business again week two. We're going to see what they do next week. It's hard for me to assess them against Nebraska because Nebraska, you know, I thought I was going to be able to get a good read on them this week, but Nebraska just didn't have any offense. I just got to call it like I said. Their offense just, it took too long. And they had all of the, you know, you had all of the uh, the turnovers, like I said earlier. So I guess I'm going to have to wait, right? Uh, I think they have Colorado State next week. But I think I'm going to have to wait until they get to Oregon or USC before I can really see what's happening. Uh, but other than that, Congratulations to Colorado, Coach Prime, and um, y'all stick together, help one another out, and I'm out.